Oaks. A woman was beaten bloody during a violent home invasion in Sherman Oaks. The terrifying ordeal happened at a home on Willis Avenue south of Magnolia Boulevard. CBS 2's Joy Benedict spoke with the woman's husband about the attack and how police finally caught the suspect. She's running down the hall to me. I see blood running down her face. Rick Gallivan didn't know what to think when his wife's screams shook this quiet neighborhood just after midnight. This makes me ill. I felt like I was in Vietnam again. The adrenaline just was wham. He was in his office, his wife in the bathroom, when someone broke into their home, finding his wife first. He just ran in there and smashed her in the face and then hit her a couple more times and she started screaming. She got away. And ran right around him and dropped her phone and he picked up her phone. Gallivan called 911 and grabbed a hammer, went out the front door and found a man standing did there. And I, I did. I said, did you hit my wife? The man took off again. But by this time, police were already looking. The helicopter overhead, the robber on the run. Cut down an alleyway and then he was hopping over fences and stuff and they, they finally caught him. Police arrested 21-year-old Kevin Farmer for for robbery. Investigators say he had an existing felony warrant and Gallivan's wife's cell phone. They called the number and it was in his pocket. But Gallivan says it wasn't just his home that was targeted. He says the suspect was peering in his neighbor's windows trying to break into nearby cars all before he was caught. He was high as a kite. And although the randomness of the crime is comforting for this homeowner, knowing he likely wasn't intentionally targeted, he doesn't know if his wife will feel the same. She's just got a huge black eye, red eye, and a big cut down below it where, where the guy hit her and drove her glasses. Gallivan says he will help her get through this, and he hopes their pain is a sad reminder for us all. You got to keep your doors and windows locked, locked, locked. Joy Benedict, CBS 2 News.